thought you'd be working. Or have you packed farming in now? You've got a new job as a home wrecker. Don't get involved with stuff you don't understand. Yeah, because you're so deep, you, Andy. You're so complex, aren't you? Has Debbie sent you here to have no, a go? No, all off my own back. Yeah? Well, I'm busy. Yeah? Well, you know what? This isn't all about you, surprisingly enough. It's about my little granddaughter. She's called Sarah Sugden. You might have heard of her. She's six and a half. She's dying. Whatever you feel about Debbie, whatever you think it is she's done, it doesn't matter, all right? What matters is keeping that little kid alive. You don't need to tell me that. Do I not? Because yesterday you were running around acting like some spoiled little brat. He deserved to know. No way. You didn't do this as some kind of noble gesture. You did it to get back at her, didn't you? And it, it worked. Guess what? He's leaving her. He stayed at the B&B &B last night. So you've ruined their entire relationship, and for what? Andy, please, do me a favour. Get over yourself. She doesn't want you. She never has. And you wrecking her life out of spite is pathetic. So, I think you might gather that I really am the team player, yeah? I've had Edna on the phone, kicking off about the news. Well, <clears throat> tell her to come to speak to me if she needs to. Well, that won't be necessary. I've calmed her down for the time being. Even better. All you need to do now is sort out third world debt and the oil crisis, and I want to cup some lunch. Oh, I bought a sandwich. We're about done here, aren't we? Well, to be honest, I, I was hoping... To, um... Katie. Don't let us keep you. I know you're a busy woman. No, no, it's fine. I'm free all afternoon, in fact. Uh, everything in here is confidential. Well, the way Declan was carrying on in the car, it won't be long before I'm access all areas. Until then, I'm just going to have to pull rank. I'm just going to have to pull rank. You lost something? Diary. Oh, I can't get the stuff these days. So, um, we really need to know if you've come to a decision. Yes, we're having a little problem establishing some kind of pecking order. You've both been really impressive. Well, I've already worked for you. It's got to count for something. I've only been here five minutes and you've ditched me already. Should have made the silver to teach you. Hi. 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 I locked up the good stuff when I knew you were coming. You shouldn't have to. You should be looking after me. This is Megan. Hmm. She's going to help knock the festival into some kind of shape. I'll knock you into shape if you run out on me again. This is my decision. Shall we? Oh. 